I'm Anil Kumar. Welcome to my series on drawing accurate graphs. We'll begin with lines. The question here is, draw the graph of y equals to 6 minus 2x using the scale 2 cm to 1 unit on the x-axis and 1 cm to 1 unit on the y-axis for given values of x from minus 2 to 4. So we are given the equation and we are also given the scale, also the values from which we need to use to sketch the graph. Now a straight line, you need actually three points uh, or five points to sketch the graph. But we'll use uh, most of the points given in this interval, including the end points, right? So let's make a table to get the coordinate points. The whole idea is to get the coordinate points. So, so first step here is to find coordinate points. So we'll take different values of x and for each value of x we'll apply the formula which is x minus 2x, right? So for different values, we know 6 is a constant so we'll do minus 2x and then we'll use 6, right? So you could also do like, like this. You can write 6 here, right? So for each value of x, we'll have 6 and then we have minus 2x, correct? So once we do that minus 2x, we get the value of y. So here we get the value of y. So y will be equal to 6 minus 2x for each and every value of x. Does make sense to you, right? So as far as x is concerned, we are taking values from minus 2 to 4. So let me write minus 2. Then we have minus 1 and then we have 0, 1. 2, 3, and 4, correct? So those are the values which has to be calculated. So let me draw these vertical lines. Once we get these coordinate points, then we will decide about the axis, right? Okay, so as far as 6 is concerned, whatever is the value, 6 is going to be constant. So let me write 6 for each one of them. Minus 2 times this means minus and minus makes it positive. So it becomes plus 4. In this case, it will be 2, 0. Here will be minus 2, minus 4, correct? Now plus minus 6 and that gives us minus 8. Now the idea is we already have these values, correct? So we have to just add them, correct? So if I add them, what do I get? 6 plus 4 is 10, right? So that's what we have. So we have 10 here. Just add them. So think like this. You are doing minus 2x, but overall, you are adding these numbers, correct? So, so the equation is y equals to 6 plus minus 2x. Think Think like this. Right. Does it make sense to you? So y plus minus 2x. Correct? So add them now. So when you add, you get 8, 6. Here we get 4, 2, 0. And this is minus 8. Correct? Well, actually, so minus 2. And on the horizontal, we have uh, 2 units. So minus 2 means there should be your y-axis, correct? So at least we can maintain the, the x-axis. Now to get 10, I got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. So I do have some room here. So I can sketch it here. Y. So this uh, is a very limited space to work with. Now, let's plot the points one by one. So the first point is that x equals to minus 2, we have 10, right? So this is like, uh, let's write down, be easy for us. So that is 2, 4, 6, 8, and 10. And here the scale is 2 units. 
So we have minus 1, that is minus 2. And this is 1, 2, and 3, correct? So that is 4 for us, but that point is going way beyond our scale. Okay. So first point is minus 2, 10. So at minus 2, we have a point which is right there. Then at minus 1, it is 8. So at minus 1, it is 8. You can see that the slope is minus 2. So we are coming down like this. So you can, that is a check. You can actually keep on moving like this to get your points and then check with the values, correct? So I think this, oh, this calculation is wrong. Okay, I should have written 6 here. And so what we get here is minus 2. That makes sense, perfect. So we can actually do it. So that calculation, I wrote 6 in the form of 0. So it's a diagonal which fits in, that's good. Okay, so let's draw this line. So it's a perfect straight line from diagonally across, correct? Line actually goes on and these are the last points which we have, right? Makes sense. So that was a calculation mistake. Perfect. So that is how you draw a graph uh, which is fairly accurate with the given scale as we talk about, correct? So that becomes the, the graph for this uh, x-axis and that is y-axis. And the equation here is y. Let's write down the equation right here. So we can write down the equation for the graph, which is y equals to 6 minus 2x. Normally, we write minus 2x. So normally, we write this as y equals to minus 2x plus 6 slope and intercept form. But either way, it is one and the same thing. So I hope you understand and appreciate how do we get the coordinate points and connecting them, we can get our line as shown here. Feel free to write your comment, share your views. And if you like and subscribe to my videos, that'd be great. Thanks for your time and all the best.